Seems like every time there's a new release of Studio One, I always see comments in my YouTube videos asking where users can download my color scheme preset. So in this video, what I wanna do is take a look at how you can use Personas Exchange to upload things like presets or sound variations or really anything that you can do in Studio One to share with the user community. That being said, let's dive into the video. All right, so my name is Marcus Huskins. First of all, if you're not yet subscribed to my channel and you enjoy what I do and you'd like to continue to support this channel, do me a favor, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell icon notification so that you can be made aware as new content becomes available. But in this video, I wanna take a look at something simple, which is uploading my version seven color scheme preset using Personas Exchange. And the reason that I would use Personas Exchange is that so this can be made available to all of the different user community all around the world. So if you've ever watched my videos and you like my particular color scheme preset, you will be able to download this after you watch this video. It will already be live and published. So if we hop over to Safari, just for a moment, if we click the Exchange tab, also worth noting that I've already pushed this up to Exchange, but we're gonna walk through how to do this here. If you click Exchange, you can browse some user content. You can check out some of the featured artists here. But in addition to that, we have the ability to upload a file. Now, basically, it is very, very easy. All you have to do is either choose the file if you know how to manually navigate to the location. But if you don't, there's a real quick and easy shortcut in Studio One, which allows you to basically locate that file. I'm gonna choose the option to load the preset, which I've already saved. If you right click, we have the ability to show in Finder. So this is on a Mac and a PC. I'm pretty sure that would say show in Explorer. Then from there, from the browser side, all you would have to do instead of choosing the file is quite simply, we could just click hold and drag and drop this. Now from there, you'll be asked to give it a title and a really simple description, and then you have the ability to upload it. Now by default, any files that are a very specific type when uploaded to Exchange, they're gonna show up in Personas Exchange as something like, for example, color schemes. So you can see there's a lot of different users who have uploaded their color schemes. And this will be available for anybody who uploads. In my particular case, uh, because I'm listed as a feature artist, you can navigate to the featured artist section over here, and you'll be able to find my category, which is Marcus Huskins. And then you'll see over here, Marcus Huskins version seven color scheme. If you wanna install that on your system, all we have to do is click this install option. And then it'll be added to your presets. And quite simply, you navigate to general appearance, load preset, and just load the MHV7 color scheme preset, and that should get you going. Anyways, wanted to do a really quick video that hopefully helps if anybody wants to have my color scheme. But in addition to that, this will hopefully help for anybody who wants to upload any files that they've created to share with the user community. My name is Marcus Huskins, and we will catch you in the next video. Cheers.